Feels like kind of like a slice of life anime opening. Ruby and Mem are gonna have just like really shocked faces once we get to see the reaction to this. <laughs> that was really good. What? Kana is way too hard on herself. Hey everyone, it's Lexion here. Welcome back to the reaction of Oshino Ko. Today I'll be watching episode 9. I actually have not filmed an outro as of recently, but if I was gonna put in a summary of the last few episodes, I would simply say. Akane is a damn good actress. We finally might be able to see who the father of Aqua and Ruby is this episode. And Mem is officially going to be an idol with Kana and Ruby in Bikamachi. And I'm excited to see her integration into the story. I think that's it. <laughs> oh, she's talking about Aqua. ピアン。年齢サバ読んでるのでしょ個人でやってる子が年齢いくつ。おお、そう、she's <笑> Don't tell me she's like my age. Double? She's 24? So she's, she's, she's my age. So 25, so that would make her kind of old to be an idol, wouldn't it? Wouldn't it? I don't know. Oh. Wow. I really respect that of her because she had to work in the area where she would have tried to thrive and succeed at a younger age. Mm. Parentheses. <laughs> oh, I just noticed Aqua shirt. Louis says Aqua with the fish. That's cool. The eye, the sparkle. <laughs> Okay, it's official. It's official. I wonder what Aka thinks about this. Just <laughs> with you kids, you're so welcoming. I mean, yeah, I, to her, they're kids. But Mem will be a great asset to the idol group, I feel like, to be Komachi. Oh yeah, that's um. Fair name. I'm pretty sure they established just a working relationship, or like a work relationship. Even Ruby kind of knows. Oh yeah, and that's also um. Shiri, Shiri, no? <laughs> can't pronounce it. <laughs> she has underhanded sarcasm. What? <laughs> I think it's because of his standoffish, cool personality. He's very independent. And also, he is unloved now, so. So, would the rights transfer over from the previous idol group to now their idol group? So, it would make them their songs? Yeah, I guess I can use her songs 
And Ruby is already a phenomenal dancer because I taught her at a very young age, so she should be probably the best in the group, I'd say. Of course, Aqua's right there. And Aqua really likes the relationship he has with Kana, the friendship. It's outside of work, it's just a... Sushi? Is, is it? Here we go. Okay, okay, okay. And the director seemingly knows more about I than probably Aqua does, I would assume. Mm-hmm. That might have been just when she land, she met her agent at uh, Ichigo. Workshop. La la la. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The, they take only the best uh, actors and actresses, don't they? Mm. So even the director doesn't know the guy. Hmm, he's too humble about himself. Oh, I see. So the director helps out Aqua, and if Aqua grows up to become a potentially famous actor, he'll be obligated to work with the director again, right? Oh. Japan Idol Festival. So the, we're going to see the director throughout the rest of, throughout the series still. It's not like he's going to go away. Because now I feel like he wants to get involved with Bikomachi. I'm sure it's an actually real festival too, isn't it? Oh yeah. Because I was the center of the previous Bikomachi. So who who would who would it be? From a popularity standpoint, men would likely be the most suited. Hmm. Um, I don't know actually who should be it. Bell pepper exercises? What is, wait, what is this? Oh, is this kind of what she did when she was younger? Peter Pan? <笑>やっぱセンターの資格って歌じゃない一発屋の子役時代が終わった後もこの業界でしぶとく生きてた私が <笑> Oh, 
子役時代の名声で仕事をくれた会社に赤字を出させまくったくせに出てきた。You know, it takes a lot of maturity to admit that, you know, for Kana to say that it wouldn't be best for the group if I was the center. Oh, yeah, it did. Yeah, Kana really has. Is she still thinking about Aqua? That in particular, of Love Now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, I, I thought the fact that Aqua just kind of uses others, you know, in a, in a way. Kind of like Kiyotaka from. Uh... Oh! So they're both bad. I'm curious, actually, who would you put to be on the centerfold of Bikumachi? I like some you can relax with. <laughs> the bell pepper exercises. Oh, she did? Full Moon by Kana Arima. I kind of like it. It feels like kind of like a slice of life anime opening. They're really putting this much effort just for like a little side thing with this, like just to have like a fake song. This is really good actually. <laughs> Even the music video is good. <laughs> what? Kana is way too hard on herself. I think just because no one really popularized the song, she just didn't think that they were that good. But sometimes that ne that's not necessarily the case. Ruby and Mem are going to have just like really shocked faces once we get to see the reaction to this. <laughs> that was really good. <laughs> Yeah, no kidding. Oh, she got 97 points? Wow! <laughs> okay, I, I, I'm officially saying that Kana probably should be at the center of Bikamashi. Just if the center is going to have the best singing aspect, she she obviously deserves it. I'm going to actually want to go download that song right now and listen to some more. Is, is that like even a thing? Was that a real song or did they just make that song up just for the sake of this episode? Because I mean, if they did that, that's that's quite impressive. <laughs>